Hi everyone, I hope you're well and today we're back at Port Vale as we're playing Cheltenham today. Dad, thoughts, opinions, score prediction? Not saying they're open, I think we'll get, I think we'll bail or win today because mm -hmm. uh, we're just slightly above them in the table, they're on four points, we're on seven. I know it's not a lot in the, shot, in the few games we've been playing but you'd have to think our form is slightly better than theirs so yeah, confident of a Vale win. But I feel like sometimes with Vale, the teams that are below us in the league, are some, you expect to win and then sometimes oh, yeah, we actually oh, yeah, we don't bring yeah. it on the day. No, oh, because like I said, they're going to give you a good game. Um, so I think games like this is always hard to predict. Score prediction? I'm going to stick with 2-0 Vale. 2-0? Oh, I was going to say 2-0. Uh, yeah, I'm going to say 2-1 Vale. Should be a good game. I'm looking forward to it. Um, should be interesting. Um, Look forward to the starting lineup. See if any of the new signings on the bench or play or anything like that. So it's currently half time, what's the first half of the game? Oh, 
Australia, very entertaining. Really entertaining. I feel like the first 10 minutes they'll be quite well and then lost it for a bit. And then yeah, yeah, I lost it for a bit. And then John went back into it. So I say we went one behind, which is a stupid, stupid goal to lose, but stuck together, come back strong. And Two good goals, two good goals, can't complain, that's what we've been waiting for. You've got it in the locker, just been facing the way. It's like they've drawn their A game. Definitely. The girl dream was the last 10 15 minutes, well, 10 minutes of that game to the second half. So, yeah, yeah, second half. Leaving the field number three, Ben Williams, number 36, James Oldman. Replacing him number 15. ended 2-2 after Cheltenham equalised in the last couple of minutes. I actually missed filming uh, their goal, but yeah, they equalised. Very frustrating when we literally had three, four minutes left of the game. Devastated, gutted. Not a lot to say, apart from the, the amount of chances we created in the second half. We should have killed the game off. It should have been out of sight, but if you don't take your chances and do that, then you've got the chance of them scoring against us, and that's what happened. Yeah, Overall, they all played really well today. There was a lot of players that stood out for me. Uh, I thought Waza played incredible. I thought Pep played really well. Ellis. Um, Foster. Yeah, just, yeah. A lot of, the, like, we played well and we had a lot of chances where Cheltenham did not have many chances at all. And the ones that they did have scored. So, it's one of them. We did play well overall. Um it's just very frustrating when there's minutes left. The yeah. cracking team effort, the team stuck, stuck together. It, it was a, probably the best performance I've seen up to now, yeah. team-wise. But obviously the results wasn't what we wanted. But yeah, thank you so much for watching this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you did. And we'll see you very soon. Goodbye.